Antonio Brown made his first court appearance on battery and burglary charges on Friday in an anti-suicide vest as a Florida judge granted him his release Brown was granted his release on $110,000 bond and ordered to wear a GPS monitor, surrender his passport, and undergo a mental health evaluation his attorney is insisting his client is innocent on battery and burglary charges stemming from an incident at his Florida home on Tuesday Brown turned himself into police on Thursday night after a moving truck driver claimed the NFL free agent and his trainer attacked him with rocks on Tuesday the incident reportedly began as an argument over the 31 year old Brown's refusal to pay $4,000 to the driver to release his household goods police say the driver suffered injuries including scratches on his neck, shoulder and arm, a cut on his finger and a scrape on his stomach prosecutors had sought no bail, claiming Brown is a wealthy flight risk and adding that police were called to his Florida home 18 times since December. A news alert now at 9 o'clock. Former NFL star Antonio Brown making his first court appearance after turning himself into authorities. It stems from a dispute that officials say escalated at the athlete's Hollywood home. Seven's Alex Browning is live outside the Broward County Jail now with more. Alex? Well, Diana Christine Brown in front of a judge a few minutes ago here in downtown Fort Lauderdale. Let's go ahead and take you to that video there. Now, Antonio Brown arrested and in front of a judge this morning after an incident earlier in the week at his house in Hollywood. That vest you see him wearing there means that jail uh, officers are concerned for Brown's safety while in custody that he may try and harm himself. Now, the former NFL star turned himself in last night after a warrant was issued for his arrest stemming from an incident Tuesday when Hollywood police say Brown and his trainer Glenn Holt assaulted a moving truck driver over a $4,000 bill uh, for services moving, I guess, uh, Brown's belongings from California to his house in Hollywood. Now, that driver did call police. Now, his uh, trainer Glenn Holt was arrested Tuesday at the scene. Brown apparently refused to come out of his house that day, Tuesday afternoon, and talked to officers. That is why they issued his uh, uh, warrant for his arrest. Eventually, Brown turning himself last night into custody here at the Broward County Jail. That is where he appeared in front of a judge just a few minutes ago. We are trying to get the details of what happened in court, whether or not uh, he was granted bond and whether or not he will post bond. Of course, as we learn more from Broward County Jail officials, we'll be sure to pass them along. For now, we are here live in downtown Fort Lauderdale. Alex Browning, today in Florida.